Hi everyone, this is Ray with the channel Love Water Healing and I am back for the month of November. We're going to be doing a reading for all of our Scorpios for this month. Happy, happy um, month of birth, <laughs> Scorpio. And if you were born in October, it's still around that time. So have the best time ever. Make those wishes. Um, and I know that they'll come true and many, many more. And we're going to be using the Flower of Life cards. Uh, and what I'm going to do is really simple now, Scorpio. I'm just going to pick one of these cards and I'm going to read it to you. And whatever resonates with you, you can take from it. If you want to have a more complete picture of your entire chart, um, or at least your entire month, <laughs> you can also look at your rising, your moon, or your... Uh, Venus, right? Because we're in your month. So it's all about that love and mystery and attraction and sexualness and all that stuff. So it should be fun. Let's see what we have for you for the month of November. You have color. It's a beautiful card. Let's see what it says. Each color of the light spectrum has its own ray and its own energetic vibration, which interact with you and affect our personal energetic vibration. Color can be a profound effect on your mood, vitality, and well-being. Today, experience the creative, healing, and calming effect that a color meditation brings. Sit quietly and connect to your breath. Imagine you are sitting under a celestial, magical, vibrant rainbow filled with many colors. Allow each pearlescent and opalescent color to flow over and through you. Gold, silver, copper, platinum, violet, purple, magenta, lilac, indigo, blue, Pink, emerald green, yellow, orange, red, and ruby. Breathe the colors in one by one and sit in each color as long as you need to. Let them all pass through and dissolve away into the light around you, into oneness. As your light channel expands, feel magic and tingling sensations moving through you, healing and soothing all of you. Connect to your breath and move back into your day with added energy, balance, and creativity. Know the treasure at the end of the rainbow resides within you. Well, there you go, Scorpio. That is perfection. If you ask me. So follow the colors, right? Take some time, even if it's an entire day and your only meditation that day is on the color gold or silver or ruby, right? Take the time to see how it makes you feel, how that color when it's presented to you in your mind's eye, what kind of emotions it brings to the surface and then work through them because you're just experiencing a perception of your reality. There's so many different perceptions of reality, especially your reality, Scorpio. Why not take the opportunity to see all the different colors and beyond of the rainbow and sit and meditate on them and see how they make you feel? You don't have to stick to the colors that I mentioned here. You can move through the colors as they present themselves to you. But realize that moving through the colors also gives you the opportunity to see a different side, a different perception of reality. And in this, it helps us to be creative, open us, um, ourselves up to more opportunities. Opportunities being that you are open to them. So it's your perception of being open to the opportunities. It's not the perception of people around you. 
It's not the perception of what you think or assume others are thinking about you, Scorpio. This is a perception of how you feel in this moment right now. And as you move forward, how you feel. It's going to be a reflection of that. So enjoy these colorful meditations as they come to you this month, Scorpio. It should be fun. We've got a lot of changes ahead. And I know that this month will bring you more joy than you've had in a long time. Each and every day, wake up and be grateful that you were able to be in this life one more time. Don't take anything for granted. And just love yourself the way you are. Uh, you know, start saying I love you in the mirror again. Start saying it every day. And you'll see a huge change in how you feel after the first three days, Scorpio. So that's your, your monthly card. I hope you enjoyed it. I love being back. You'll see me more often. Please and thank you. As always, love your water. Right? Write love on it, as you can see. And love yourself. And I will see you on the next video. I love you.